Hi friends, this is Mohamed Shakil here and today I'm going to talk about the color schemes in Katia V5. So Katia V5 allows you to use various different color schemes and as a background and uh, the different entities you can see on the screen can also be changed uh, in the sense of the color. So what I'm going to show you is I'm going to start up uh, with the part design workbench so that I can open up some workbench and uh, I can explain you. So already in this case the color is being changed. The background color is actually something different in Kitty V5. So I'm going to show you how I have uh, changed the color scheme. So go to the tools and uh, select the options and go to the dip display, select the visualization and you have the different colors which you can see over here. So browse to the colors and take the color which you are uh, uh, which you prefer according to the work you're doing and once you are selected the color just click on OK and the color will be changed. And uh, <clears throat> let's just get into the sketch. So sometimes uh, you know uh, you really you know when you take a light color uh, as a background you need a darker color when you're uh, working uh, for this sketch. So go to the options once again and uh, go to the sketch here and sketcher and you can actually uh, select a different color so in this case I have uh, used the red color so you can actually use the uh, maybe the dark blue color and just try the giving the sketch so uh, the purpose of the tutorial is just to uh, let my let the users of the Kitia users know that you can actually change the color if required so but uh, the main thing what I want, what I want to say is, uh, you know, if you change the color, if you change the color, and uh, if it doesn't match, say, the, uh, I, I just want to say that the planes which you can see over here, their color need to be changed every time you open up a file. So the main thing is, if I click close over here, and if I open up a new design the color which I have set for the sketch as well as the background remains the same whereas the color of the plane is always white so if you're comfortable making it white say um, I'll just change the color of the plane uh, this is a way of changing the color of the plane if at all you require so I'm gonna change the color of the white uh, color of the plane go to uh, graphics and you can see lines and curves just uh, select a different color for this so maybe a dark blue click on OK you can see the color of the plane is being changed so the main thing which you should keep in your mind is don't expect the color of the plane to be uh, the same when you open up a new file so when you open up a new file the color of the plane remains as white but whereas the other options remains different uh, so sometimes it is uh, really cumbersome to uh, change the color of the plane every time you create a new plane because every time you create a new plane the plane is gonna get created in the white color so uh, keep this point in your, in your mind before changing the uh, the <coughs> the colors and the preferences and if at all required this is the way you can change it so I hope you uh, enjoyed this tutorial and I hope uh, this tutorial is gonna help for some of the people who are uh, looking for changing the colors and uh, that's all and thank you so much for watching.